Okay, you may notice the slightly unusual surroundings. I'm currently sat on the train between uh, Wellingborough and Kettering, uh, having just had the slightly strange announcement that there's a security alert at Kettering Station. The station's been evacuated and all trains have been stopped. Yet somehow that seems slightly appropriate and strangely ironic given the reading I'm supposed to be doing a thought for the day on is and all those who call on the name of the Lord will be saved so clearly in times of suffering in times of trial in times of fear and panic we'll be calling on the name of the Lord hopefully today's incident is just a hoax but it brings into sharp focus that actually there are many dangers around. It's really easy for us to to be complacent, to take our safety for granted. If we look at the, the wider context of the passage from Acts, Peter's just got up to address the crowd at Pentecost. It's this strange situation where people are talking in a language, in their own native tongues, and yet people are worried, are they, are they drunk? situations where we do have to call on the name of the Lord to be saved. Do we really tell others enough about the times when we've really had to dig deep, we've really had to cry out to say, Lord, help me? Do we share the joy that that brings with other people? My prayer to you today is that one, you won't have to need to cry out to the Lord, but actually you remember that you can, and then that you can, my prayer is that you'll tell others just what it means to be able to call on the Lord, and he'll come and save you. Amen.